and welcome to the studio. I am going to show you how I built the Camaleonda sofa from scratch with no experience. Have I done woodworking before? No, this is not a woodworking channel. Have I done upholstery, sewing, any of these things before? No, I'm just a creative girl with a dream and a budget and I figured out how to make it happen. So I am going to be showing you a three-part series of how I brought this beauty to life. I've got a lot of content on what not to do <laughs> and what worked for me as a novice so that anyone like me who's just like, I got some free time and I want an expensive sofa for like this much of the price. If that's something you're interested in, keep watching and you'll see my fails, my fixes, and some fun moments along the way. <laughs> slept. I'm so excited about renting this truck and going to Home Depot today. So let's get it. I was delusional enough to think I could cut this by hand and then continue to fail. This is comedy! of all get you a man who will help you build a couch working with the table saw was kind of a challenge i definitely recommend watching lots of safety videos before using one and it was definitely a two-person job one person holding the big slab and the other one holding the excess this was my finesse after i returned the table saw i did the miter saw halfway flipped it around it's not very official but it worked for me top quality stuff here <laughs> When you do it, not on a table saw, let's see if you can see it, yeah, like the girls be doing, so you can see that, but that's easy to sand off with MDF. <laughs> Smart. Dang it. Dang it. Also, probably don't recommend doing this on your granite counter. <laughs> this is all we got.